Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another edition of Tank Tries. Oh correction, happy Easter edition of Tank Tries. Well, the thing I will be trying today is these new um, corn nut flavors. So we have this company called Love Corns and they have apparently they're a vegan corn nut so this one is smoky barbecue flavor vegan cheddar cheese vegan cheese and sea salt so we're just gonna start out with the sea salt version here and uh I've never really tried anything really vegan, like foods, ever, because I'm not vegan, and I'm, I don't know, that's more vegetarian stuff, or like, you know, they eat vegetables and stuff like that, but the thing is, I may be a meat eater, but I like to eat a salad here and there, you know, I've just never had vegan type food, so, uh, Let's uh, try this. Huh. Oh, okay, I see. It's uh, like they're showing some recipes and stuff that you can use the corn nut, these corn nuts in with. So, this is the sea salt one. One moment. Hold that thought. <sighs> Clear the palate after each little try here. Let me just take a swig now. Got some high quality H2O. Good old water. So now, we're gonna try this one. I've had corn nuts before, by the way. That, literally, my gosh. They're corn, like little corn. Let's give the sea salt one a try. That tastes like a corn nut. Salty corn nut. Kind of bland. It's bland. It's good, but bland. You know, it's just got a little salt on it. It's good in its own right. I would. Go ahead and if you want to try this one, go ahead and give it a try. Set that aside. Next we will try the vegan cheddar version. But one second. Back to the water. <laughs> okay, now we try the vegan cheddar flavor of Love Corns. So let's see what is snack, party snack, good in adding like crunchy toppers for salads, etc. etc. Now let's open these up and give these ones a try. If you're hearing stuff in the background, that's okay. Mm. 
Okay, these don't really have a scent. Now it's just another corn nut. I'm guessing it has cheesy powder on it. Smells like cheese. Let's uh, give it a try. Okay. It's definitely got a cheesy flavor to it. It's definitely good. With the cheesy corn nut flavor. It gives more of the nutty taste out of it and uh, more of that cheese kick to it. And uh, yeah, if you want to, I would recommend this one. It's quite good. Time to clear the palate again for the final one. Is it water or is it booze? You decide. <laughs> Spill splattered a little bit. <laughs> okay, now it's time for the smoky barbecue flavored one. Smoky BBQ. You definitely get a barbecue scent right away when you open the thing and give it a whiff. Like once again, it's kind of a more brownish color or a like yeah, like a brownish color. Let's give it a taste. That one didn't really have anything flavor to it. Let's uh grab another piece for a Okay, that one did. One moment. Maybe this is some of the powder or the season. Might have moved to the bottom of the bag, you never know. Okay, there we go. Now that's a proper tasting barbecue out of the three so far give me a, I gotta just go a couple here hmm that's good that is good ladies and gentlemen um what am I doing Now, we must try them all. Okay, fine. Got the sea salt, the vegan cheddar. the barbecue. A couple shakes of the barbecue. See all that in my hand? All of it. Oop. Down the hatch.
Okay. They're all together. They it was all delicious. You got all the different flavors mixtured, and the taste of it was like they're having a party in my mouth, and everybody's invited, and there's no fucking cover charge. Now, which one do I consider the, my favorite from these three um I'll make my decision in one, two, three. Yes, I prefer out of all of them the vegan cheddar flavored. They're quite good. And second place would be the barbecue flavored because I just enjoy barbecue flavored items. They're delicious. I'm making ribs today for Easter supper and uh, they're gonna be good some sweet good sweet baby rays with a little hint of honey on there to make that really good. And my least favorite is just because it was so bland, it was uh, the sea salt. But they're all good in their own right. Um, this will still get eaten. This would actually be great on a uh, salad I'll probably plan on making here shortly. And actually all of these would, all of them would probably be very good on top of a salad. Maybe even the cheese one. I don't know about the barbecue one on the salad, but who knows. So, thank you for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, remember to like, comment, and subscribe. And have a very good Easter with your friends, your family, and your children. Just have a wonderful day. And just remember, have a good time today tomorrow and the next and in the future just continue to have a good day bad days will come but you'll get past them that's thanks for the day you'll get past them and you'll be stronger you'll be a stronger person with that so peace out much love thanks for the day audi peace